was as a child that said I talked too much. I'm going to start with a short story. And if anyone has more information about this particular people, I would love to hear it because I'm going to try to do some research and find out who the people are that this story comes from. But I'm told that there's a, a nation in East Africa where when a woman is ready to conceive a child, she goes and sits beneath a tree. And she humbles herself and she waits until she hears a song for that child. And when she learns the song, she takes it to her partner and teaches it to him so that when they make this baby, they sing the song together. And when it's time for the baby to come forth, all of the midwives and the aunties and the grandmothers from the village learn the song so they can welcome the child into life with this song. As the child is a toddler and moves around in the village, if he should fall and hurt himself, that song is sung. And through all of life's transitions, puberty, marriage, and even death, the song is sung. Because you see, as the child is about to go back to his maker or her maker, that song is sung to the spirit of that child. Unfortunately, in this